Follow these instructions for upgrading your Cocoon Create 3D printer to version 2.1. Included in the upgrade kit are four thumb wheels. These are replacements for the wing nuts and they will help you uh, level your bed much easier than previously. Replace the thumb wheels just by unscrewing the wing nuts and then screw on the new thumb wheels. The next step is a little trickier. Here you have to remove the extruder assembly and we'll tip the printer over and you can access the screws on the bottom of the extruder assembly and using your included Allen key, unscrew these two screws. Then you'll be able to pull the extruder assembly off. What we're really after are these six bolts behind the extruder assembly that are currently holding in the existing bearings. So you're going to need to access these bolts. We're going to have to remove these two rods from the housing. So it's easiest to access the screws holding these rods in by turning your printer upside down and then locating the tiny screws holding the rod in. The top one is easy, you can see it. The bottom one is not easy. The best way to access the bottom one is to pull the belt down and then um, you'll have to feel your way in to find the tiny screw inside the housing. This is not an easy step, and it may take a little bit of time. Once you loosen both of these screws on this side of the rod, you get to go to the other side of the rod and loosen both of those as well. Once you've loosened both sides of the rod, gently pull the rods to one of the sides. Now that the rods are free from the housing, you're able to access those bolts that we pointed out earlier. So let's remove all six of those bolts and keep them aside. Once you've loosened all the bolts, now just slide out the old bearings and slide in the new bearings. Note you only need two of the new bearings where previously you had three. Yes, two bearings are indeed better than three in this instance and this will prevent the belt rubbing issue in future and provide stability for your prints. Now replace the bolts, that was four on the bottom and two on the top. Now push the two rods back in so they're just inside the housing on both sides. And the easiest part of all, screw in those two screws holding in both of the rods. Don't forget to tighten them on both sides. Finally, replace the extruder housing and screw back in those two bolts. Congratulations, you have successfully upgraded your Cocoon Create 3D printer.